The World Cup series has started and today we've got Jack Grealish's for a play review. New promo, Path to Glory. Well, these cards can potentially go from an 87 up to a 92. They can have a plus five brain if they win the World Cup. Today I've picked out Jack Grealish, 118k, he's 5'11", high medium work rates, 4 star skin with 3 star weak foot. Has the controlled accelerate and has unique body type. After this video we will have a look to see if he can become explosive or lengthy. So quick look at the card, I'm probably just going to go with a hunter on him. He's got nice dribbling, he's got good passing, physically he's got good physicals as well. So I'm more than likely just going to go with a hunter, boost that pace and shooting up, see what he's like in game. Controlled accelerate is quite good. You know, explosive doesn't seem to be the way forward at the moment. The player traits got the flair and playmaker and the technical dribbler. Really nice player traits for a for a cam or a left winger. We're going to play him in a few different positions. We're going to play him in the cam. We're going to play him in the left wing. Probably the right wing is going to be probably going to be his best position because of them outside the foot shots on the right hand side. Obviously, finesses are not that good this year, so we're going to play a few games of foot champs and let's see how we get on. Greenish or oh, with the over kick. Through for Greedish. Moves the goalkeeper out of the way, outside the first shot. I don't think he would have saved it anyway, unless he moved the goalkeeper outside. But great finish anyway, good run. Gets himself away from both defenders. Again, it's great play from Grealish. Look how silky he is on the ball. So he's done them little step overs to get that speed boost. On the outside of the foot, there we go from Grealish. What a goal! You can work the corners nicely, get in that position of the outside of the foot shot. Always going in. Grealish nicks it off the defender. Oh, and Minix missed the ball. Nice. So look at the dribbling, the play all round from Grealish. Great finisher, great dribbling on this game. There we go, posting in on this finish as well. Plays the one, two. Sends the fender, just can't get the finish. Can't give him too much time. You can't give this boy too much time. You may not have the outside of the foot shot or the outside of the foot trait, but what a goal. Doesn't have the long shot take, is what I meant to say. Grealish on a wonderful run. Sets it back for Milik. What a finish with his right foot as well. Grealish goes for the Trevella. It's a great run, still holding on to the ball. It's just unlucky not to get around that last defender. Nice turn from Grealish. Turns back the other way. Oh, it's just over the bar. Can't get the finish from Grealish so far. Now, final verdict on Grealish. Now, I played four games with him, four goals, two assists. I really enjoyed him. Like I said, he's got some nice, obviously, skill moves, which are good. Four staffs. The weak foot's not great. Obviously, you can play in the cam and left mid. Two good positions, two good alternative positions, I think. Obviously, the Hunter chemistry style works really well with him. He's already got really nice agility. His ball control is very high on the game already. You'd suggest, you think England would probably get to the quarterfinals, maybe the semi final stages. So, again, this car could probably potentially go up to an 89 90 rated. You'd expect England to get out of the group at least. Least. Like I say, we expect England to probably go far in this tournament, so probably a couple of upgrades on this card already as well to boost him up. Now, as you can see, he's dropped down to around 87k. Obviously, he cannot be made lengthy at all, but he can be made explosive. It depends on you. I think he's better being controlled, especially on the PS5 version. Explosive on the PS5 version is terrible. If you're seeing clips of Vinicius Jr., how slow he is on the game because he's explosive, you'll know why. Controlled, more or less any chemistry style apart from the artist, engine, or finisher makes him controlled. So, for that reason, I would keep him on control because I feel like that's going to be the best way to have him in game. Now, in terms of links, you're not going to have to worry about this guy too much. He's English, plays in the Premier League, loads of good links as well. He's got really nice player traits. That's why he's so silky in game. Flair, technical dribbler, playmaker. 
So if I'm going to give the guy a rating out of 10, I'm going to give him a 9. Just because the fact is I feel like he's going to get at least a plus 2 upgrade. Obviously, for every round that the nation goes through, he'll get a plus 1. So, like I said, I assume that England are going to make out the group and at least go past the round 16 stage. That would be a plus 2 on this card. Again, making it even very... Making this a very nice card to have in your team. Potentially, England might go further than we would expect. You just don't know with, obviously, the World Cup. You know, potentially could go to a 90-91, depending on how far they got. So, like I said, really enjoyed using this card. 9 out of 10 for me. Like I said, his pace is really good. His shooting. You need to keep a hunter chemistry style on him to get the most out of him. His passing's already good. His dribbling's already really good. So, for that reason, you put the hunter on him just to give him that pace boost and shooting. If you are looking to get cards like Jack Grealish in your team, join my Discord group down below. We've got traders in there making hundreds of thousands of coins every single week. Join that link below, and we'll see you in the next video.